Hey guys, it's Pete from Secure Solutions. We've got Dean from Hike Vision today, who's brought the new Hike Vision thermographic camera, and we just want to show you its features and what this camera can do. So, so this camera, Pete, is the um, is our new latest technology. This is for uh, elevated temperature uh, monitoring of anybody coming into a uh, office. Um, so basically, given the the dual has a dual lens on there, so one of them is optical, so this one sees what we see, and then we have the thermal sort of side there. And as we're moving around, it also has the facial recognition or the facial detection technology. So it's monitoring anything within inside that particular area, and and whether it's got a elevated temperature as somebody comes through. I know she got. What's this camera? That's given a very fishbowl wide angle view. What's that? Yep. So this camera here, in conjunction with the with the thermographic camera, gives you a whole situation awareness. So basically, we get to see everything as to where people may have come in from to where they've gone. Yeah. Okay. Dean, so, I can see there's a blue box in the middle. So I'm assuming that's our focal point. So when we set this up and the the traffic of people are coming through. Is that correct? Is yeah. that, so, that's so that's the actual region that we that we start from number one. Yep. Is that anything into 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 that particular region? Well, then we'll have the green screen come up there as well. And I can see that you're thirty six point three degrees, so you're okay. So basically, as people walk through, is that um, we, we use face detection. Um, so therefore, if you have a hot cup of coffee or something else that that has um, quite a hot uh, sort of temperature to it, it's going to ignore that. So it's only going to focus on anything that's within inside this area, being the, the actual sort of face there. So if I turn around, you'll notice that that green square's dropped. Yep. Um, because it doesn't have eyes and a nose and a mouth there. So we're actually looking for face has come through, and then that's going to start monitoring the temperature to reduce false alarms. Oh. So, so Pete, to, um, to actually simulate a uh, elevated temperature, I've, I've actually got a bottle here with, um, with some warm water in it. And um, so as I walk through here, you'll actually notice that the alarm will be triggered of the elevated temperature. And then on the operator screen here, there'll be a pop-up that comes through. So therefore, a guard or a person can be then notified of this uh, temperature, um, elevated temperature. And that could be via a push notification, an email, um, and also, or an alert that's come through on the actual camera itself. So that detection, that can then go to a, a database. So it could be emailing for all the events of the elevated temperature it's detected for that day. 100% yes. And then from there, we've actually got a snapshot of the person that's actually triggered that particular event. So therefore, it makes it very, very quick to, um, to distinguish as to who that uh, triggered that uh, particular event or the elevated temperature. So you might have a series of five people come through in very close sort of succession, bearing in mind 1.5 metres apart. And then that person, third person come through, has come through with elevated temperature. The alarm comes through and it's, then that person can actually be taken aside and, and, and just basically second screening. Or they might be asked to sit down for five minutes just in case they've um, been quite warm walking into the premises. So Dean, I'm picking up the application for this just seems to be endless. I mean, education, business, mining, healthcare, retail, knowing that someone's coming in with an elevated temperature uh, is so important to just health and safety. Yep, and receiving that notification on when that person's come through with elevated temperature and then just knowing where to look and when to look. Mm, excellent.